Hello and welcome to our first edition of NYFA News. I'm Roger Richardson. We begin tonight with a look at the top stories. This spring, Mayor Bloomberg's office launched the City Bike Initiative. And while many New Yorkers enjoy renting bikes at their leisure, there have been many complaints. Rob, how important is the influence that a coach has in a young athlete's life, both on the ice and off? What do you think the secret is to good barbecue? Is it the sauce? Is it the seasoning? It's the love. Love's the best ingredient. So uh, as long as it's cooked from the heart? Yes. He begged the question, do you believe in miracles? And he answered it with a resounding yes. Miriam is on the team now. She's, she wears a burqa. She's a Muslim girl. And one of the things that I say to you know my hockey friends is, you haven't done anything until you've coached a little girl with a burqa under her hockey helmet. Speaking of delicious, everyone loves ice cream. And especially during these hot summer months, who doesn't want to indulge in something cold? But this isn't just any old ice cream. This is much cooler. Working out in a gym can get a little stuffy. But Chelsea Park offers a way to get into shape and enjoy the summer sun at the same time. Last Thursday, President Obama once again called on Congress to let him close the Guantanamo Bay Detention Center. It's unofficial, but Apple is said to be ready to launch a new generation of the iPhone. Senator Lindsey Graham is among those most against the release of prisoners and the closing of the base, even referring to the inmates as crazy bastards that want to hurt us. Carlos the Jackal. The Venezuelan native is a self-identified Marxist-Lenist who is serving a life sentence in France for the killing of 11 people. In a city that rewards creativity, this New Yorker is well on her way to couture. Mallory draws her inspiration from films, the streets of New York, and her favorite artists. Art is a huge inspiration for me. If I go to a museum and I see a Van Gogh painting or anything, I can get inspiration anywhere. Breaking news concerning the pending A-Rod suspension. Major League Baseball has offered to reduce the suspension to 150 games if A-Rod will drop his appeal. While his suspension is pending, A-Rod is permitted to continue to play, a decision that has exposed number 13 to some not-so-friendly crowds. While the Yankees await a decision, the Rangers have received one, and it's great news. The NHL has announced two games that will be played outdoors at Yankee Stadium next season. Let's go Rangers! Let's go, Rangers. For NYFA News, I'm Roger Richardson, wishing you a pleasant evening. Thanks for watching.